hello everyone and welcome to my channel i'm Tebi banjo i'm a youtuber in lagos nigeria and if you're new here make sure you do subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell symbol so you do not miss any of my uploads so kindly give this video a thumbs up and let's just get right into this video after the intro right, so these are all the things i have gotten for my um keto you know keto season keto episode that is coming up really soon and i'm going to be sharing with you guys everything i got how much it is how i will be using it and i'm also thinking of making a um keto nigerian keto meal prep let me know if you guys are interested in that so i will be able to film that for you so let's just start with everything we have here i'm putting them by the side because I don't want to miss anything I'm doing so let's start all right so the first thing on my list I'm going to start with my um, condiments and first thing on my list is of course my mayonnaise I can't do without this I use this for my salads for shawarma for you know dipping sauce and so on and so forth and I got this for I think 1300 naira, 1400 it shouldn't be more than 1500 naira if you're going to get this and I got this from the store where I work in the markets that's Okiari Market Lagos Island most of these things that's where I got it from I didn't get it from a particular store or I don't know <laughs> and also this is zero carb oh wait yes this is zero carb this is zero sugar and this is the only mayonnaise i trust this and bama these are the only two mayonnaise i trust for keto also i have here this um salad dressing this is a salad dressing that i got i haven't tried it before although it has sugar in it it has sugar it has carbs in it but you know with a little bit of calculation here and there i'll be able to make do with this i'll be fine with this and i'm just trying to look for where it is so per 100 ml of this um salad dressing you have 6.4 grams of carbohydrates and remember you have to keep your carbohydrates below what's it called 10 grams of sorry yeah yes you have to keep your carbs below 10 grams when you're on a keto diet so i think you should be doing maybe 50 ml of this in your salad dressing why would you be putting 50 ml of this in your salad dressing i don't know so if you are putting 50 ml in your salad dressing you should have about 3.2 grams of carbs which is totally fine and of course it has sugar but that's like 2.9 grams 2.9 grams um it won't be doing too much harm <laughs> or taking you off ketosis if you're on a keto diet because carrots also has sugar in it and it doesn't knock you out of ketosis so this is fine let's just take a good look at it So the next thing I bought is <laughs> obviously butter. Blue band butter. I think everybody knows blue band butter. And guys, it has zero carbs, zero, zero sugar. And why not go for blue band? Some other sugars, some other butter have butters, butter have sugar, some have carbohydrates in them, but blue band doesn't have. And lately I've fallen in love with them bread and butter before it used to be bread and mayonnaise now it's bread and butter and once i get my hands on almond bread this is going to be you know the go along and again i got this from the market not from any store but you can obviously find this in any store around you so this shawarma sauce i have been seeing it in a lot of places you know i've been seeing pictures of it everywhere i decided to get it and before i got it i looked at the um composition the nutritional information there and i found that it has um carbs in it and this is 400 ml it has a total of 10 grams of carbs 2.9 grams of sugar almost the same thing as this one so with a little bit of calculation here and there you'll be fine using this as i could use this as a salad dressing for myself or whenever i want to make keto shawarma i can use this also so let's take a closer look at this also Moving on, still on condiments. What else is the condiment here? 
it's olive oil condiment anyways i got olive oil that i'm going to be using to fry all my food this is a very good oil if you watch my previous video where i talked about nigerian anti-aging foods i mentioned olive oil this is good for your heart good for your arteries doesn't clog your heart or anything doesn't clog your bloodstream it doesn't contain any cholesterol and all those you know bad things you hear about bad oils this is good for your body and will do so much good and not any harm to your body so i'm going to be using this to fry my food i'm also going to be using this to make maybe dressings or dipping sauce mix this with my dipping sauce or anything i know you know you can just be creative with olive oil anything you want to do with this and so it contains um zero carbs zero sugar um, it has monosaturated mono unsaturated which saturates who needs all that the most important thing to check is carbs and sugar guys once i check carbs and sugar i'm fine so this doesn't contain carbs this doesn't contain sugar so here is a closer look i think i'm done with the condiments for now or if i pick up pick up anything and it falls on that condiment this is next on my list this is almond milk and even if you're not on the keto diet please just get almond milk see the last time i took cow milk <laughs> i was bloated i was purging i was in pains my bowel was upside down what else and that was the last time i took milk although i took it in excess i know i overdid it i took it in excess and since then i didn't go near cow milk again that was still this year i think about three four months ago and since then i didn't go near milk again so if i'm to eat oats if i'm to make something um that has to do with milk i use either almond milk or um coconut milk so it depends even if you're not on a keto diet i mean if you're on a low carb diet or you just want to cut out cow milk from your diet please go for almond milk zero carbs zero sugar zero you can even make your own almond milk yourself people make their almond milk their, themselves people make their coconut milk themselves so this is um, this contains zero carbs zero sugar and has just total fat three percent it doesn't even have fat in it so this is fine for your keto diet and i'm going to be using this to make ch um, chia pudding chia pudding um pottage or por it's not porridge it's pottage <laughs> chia puddings i'm going to be using it to maybe if i want to um bake or i want to make pancakes which i don't think i will be making i'll be using this and i got this for 1500 naira only I got this um, hen sauce for I think 800 naira or 1000 I'm not sure because I bought everything together and I'm not sure about how much each one was and I told you it was in the market not any store that I have to check the receipt so this should not be more than 1000 naira this um laser oil here i got it for 2000 naira and it's really big this is one liter so this should do i used to use soy um sesame oil before but it has this burnt smelling it gives my food and i don't really like it so and um olive oil was so expensive for me to buy so i was just using normal oil but you know we want to do it the right way this time we have to use the right thing and this salad dressing here this salad dressing i got it for i think one thousand or one two i really can't remember but i don't think it's more than one thousand five hundred naira blue band here i got this for five hundred naira pretty cheap this is the medium size it has a smaller size that one goes for i think 400 then there's the bigger size which goes for 900 naira next on my list is Tea. I got chamomile tea. This is a very good tea. Good for calming. Herbal infused calming tea. Of course, zero sugar, zero carbs. And I just got this so I can be taking this in the night after a long day at work. And when I get home, I can, you know, rest, take this tea and have a good night's sleep. Especially when I'm on a keto diet, this will just calm me down. And as it's written here, it writes, act as antibacterial agent preserver 
prevents diabetes, prevents cancer, calm muscle spams, acts as stress reducer. Obviously, this is exactly what I need in my life. And I got this for 1,000 Naira again in the market. The next is coffee. <laughs> oh my God, I don't think I can do keto without coffee. It's not going to happen. I need that caffeine. Caffeine is important. It's like drugs for me when I'm on keto. So in the morning before I have anything to eat, you know, I'm kind of a person that likes to eat very early in the morning. So if I don't get what to eat in the morning, I need to put something in my mouth, something that will give me energy. And caffeine does just that for me. And I'm going to be having this maybe bulletproof coffee or without bullets. So this is normal gold blend coffee with caffeine there's a decaffeinated de one also if you want but this one is caffeinated coffee and i got this for i think i think um 1800 to maybe 2000 naira i don't think it sells for 2000 naira the one that's 2000 naira is the um, the decaffeinated one like who buys decaf who buys decaffeinated coffee hello so this is the one i got and I got this for I think 1,800 naira. All right, next <laughs> is this noodles I found. I was so happy when I found these noodles. You guys, you cannot imagine. I've been looking for zero noodles ever since. And because here in Nigeria, I, I don't know, keto sauce are kind of difficult for us to get. Not, how will I put it? Like when I watch people that are on keto in America and I see they, they can easily get bread, they can easily get keto tortillas, they can easily get keto rice, keto noodles. And I'm like, where am I going to find? I've been looking for shirataki noodles all over and I haven't found it. And then I found this one in the same place I bought most of this stuff. And this is slim pasta spaghetti, zero carbs, zero gluten, guys. It's zero carbs zero carbs zero sugar i was elated <laughs> i was so happy let me not tell you what happened as soon as i posted this on my instagram story <laughs> people were messaging me saying it tastes like shit it tastes like dirt it is not sweet blah 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 <laughs> and i was saying <laughs> this thing that <laughs> looks like a salvation whatever to me like if you know how much I crave noodles or pasta when I'm on keto, I hope this saves me. I think I've watched somebody who made use of something like this and she said people always complain that they don't like it, they don't like the taste, blah blah blah. It tastes like rubber. I mean, if it tastes like rubber, it means it's fine. It tastes like rubber. And she said that's because we don't drain the water from it because it comes really soaked. So you have to drain the water, fry it out and let the water come out before you put it in your sauce or before you cook it as your meal. Not just transferring it like this into the sauce or into the um, meal that you want to make so hopefully i'll try her method and i don't complain because guys if this thing is good i'll be so happy so i got this for i think 2500 naira and <laughs> i can't wait to try it from the same market also Next on my list is uh, my holy grail, Siloam husk. I can't do keto without Siloam husk because my swallows have to come alive. So this is what I use for my eggplants and my life. I'm going to make cabbage fufu also. This is what I use. This acts as a binder for any of my meals that I'm making. So this is Siloam husk and this is the small one. It is fiber. It is not a chemical. People ask me what is Siloam husk made of and I'm like it's fiber. You can chew it. <laughs> it just acts as a binder so i got this for 1500 naira from the same person in the market next on my list are my seeds although i have opened this one because you don't even have to be on a keto diet before you use chia seeds you can sprinkle them on your salads you can sprinkle them on your smoothies and <laughs> i didn't even know that um chia seeds has carbohydrate i don't used to <laughs> I just used to eat this tea. Like, for me, I didn't know this type of seeds will have carbohydrate. But moving on, it says here that it has a total of 11.81 grams, which is more than the grams of this one here. Oh. And more than the grams of this one here. So, uh, this too is fine for keto. If chia seed can have so much um, carbohydrate, these two are fine for keto for me. So, I will be, you know, calculating 
all of that before i can use it i used to take it when i was on keto like i used to take it as sheer puddings and that's what i'm going to be using for these two they go hand in hand when i'm about to make my chia pudding or my chia pottage i don't know what's it called oats so this is water you want to soak it inside water it swells up and it looks like tapioca it tastes really nice so i got this size this is um 150 gram there's 250 gram there's 300 gram i got this size for 1500 naira the next seed i have i got flax seed and this is the first time i'm going to be using flax seed i saw some flax seed but i don't think i've seen anybody use some flax seed for anything so me i don't even know what i'm going to use some flax seed for so i got some flax I got flax seed. <laughs> I got flax seed, and of of course, flax seed also has carbs. It has 28 grams of carbs. It doesn't have sugar. Good thing it doesn't have sugar. So you have to be very careful when you are using this flax seed. Make sure you read the content. And it says here per 100 gram, it contains 28 grams of um carbohydrates so i'm wondering how am i supposed to anyways it's not like i'm eating flaxseed as a meal i'll just sprinkle it on my salad or if i make a keto smoothie i will put it on top just for energy and all of that so here is my flaxseed i hope it tastes nice because flaxseed is also an anti-aging um component or anti-aging food and if you haven't seen that video i'm going to leave a card here so you can check that out and minus 10 years from your age stop asking me how i look this cute watch the video okay all right so next thing i got is coconut poundo i love my swallows guys so i got this coconut pound from somebody on instagram and i'll leave a handle here i've gotten some things from her before and her, her stuff are really nice it's um keto ng it's from keto ng and i'll leave her handle here i'll leave her handle also in the description box below and this contains zero carbs zero sugar zero see once i just look and i see zero carbs zero sugar it's fine for me like i'm good to go so this is just um i think it's just coconut flour and xylem husk this is something you can make yourself let me try and open it for you guys so you can see what it looks like inside so this is what it looks like it's just coconut flour and xylem husk mi mixed together and once you mix this with hot water it turns to fufu or pounder as it says here coconut pound i think i got this for i think i got this for i think 2000 naira or 1500 naira and just and she sells um eggplant flour also if you can't i mean if you don't have the energy to make the whole blending cooking of the eggplant you can buy the flour that one is pretty easy to make so this is i think 2009 i forgot to mention the price of this flax seed this flax seed is um 350 gram there's another one that is 500 gram bigger than this and i got this for 3000 or so 3000 naira and the rest of the things i got were as uh, spices you guys know i don't joke with my spices and i stopped using seasoning cubes so i have incorporated a lot of other things i'm going to be using to replace my spices and here i have ground cinnamon i didn't just get this i have i've had this a long time my sister gave it to me probably she doesn't know the use <laughs> she doesn't know this is gold <laughs> so i gladly collected it from her and i'm going to be using this to make coconut flakes later on for um that i'm going to be putting on my chia puddings when i make them um, chia puddings i'll sprinkle coconut flakes on it all right so most of my spices are things you know that are associated with me i got garlic ginger and here are some of the new ones i got these are just the tiny ones this were like 100 now 200 now i got cloves and this is a numbing or pain reliever that i've always been using whenever i have pains i like to put this in my tea also sometimes when i come back from work and i'm tired i just put like one or two of this in my tea you can also put them in your food people put them in their food but i haven't put it in my food yet so i don't know how it tastes and i bought black pepper also i have to grind this before use or if i throw it into my food i have to like look for it and bring it out later better you just grind it and put in your food i also got fenugreek seeds i haven't really used these fenugreek seeds before 
but they look really nice and cute <laughs> they look cute so this is fenugreek seed it smells so much like a um, seasoning cube i don't know but i heard if you grind this with them um, chicken stock and some other made made you have yourself good powder for seasoning i also got um ginger garlic like i mentioned earlier other things i got would be herbs and um like parsley celery basil and so on and so forth and everything you are not seeing here now is in the fridge they are either protein or vegetables which you guys know about but this here that i showed you now are things that most people do not know about are the things that i really really use use so much in order to enjoy my journey and i decided to share it with you guys so if this video was helpful don't forget to share it to people who would like to go on a keto diet and i hope i was able to like you know elaborate so much on the prices and i'm sorry if I could not give you a particular place where you can get all this from like i said earlier i work in the markets and you know i like to walk, walk up and down inside the market so i was able to shop for this in different places so thank you so much for watching and if you haven't given this video a thumbs up please give this video a thumbs up and if you made it to this point and you haven't subscribed fam <laughs> this is the channel you want to be on anyways please kindly hit the subscribe button give this video a thumbs up hit the notification bell so you do not miss any of my uploads and if you're looking for other videos to watch i'm going to leave them card in the description down below also you can click on the ones that appear on the screen either here or here and i'll be sure to see you in my next video thank you so much and bye